Hello everyone and welcome back to our roller series and in today's video we're going to take you through the correct startup procedure for one of our Bomag 120 twin drum rollers. Now to start with we need to make sure that we enter the machine using three points of contact for safety. Follow me. So to help us with our three points of contact we've got a handlebar on the console and we've also got a handle here on the operator seat to assist us. Now when safely in your seat, you need to do is grab your seat belt, which you'll find on your right hand side and make sure you secure it on the left hand side as well. Now please note that the machine will not operate without that seat belt engaged. Compliance is shown by the green beacon above you, flashing green when the machine is turned on. Once you've got that seat belt on, you can now adjust your seat accordingly to your liking by using the lever on the left hand side, which moves the seat backwards and forwards. The lever in between your legs which will recline the seat backwards and forwards and finally the lever just behind you on the left hand side which will heighten or lower the rear, uh, the rear of the seat. Once you're all strapped in now ready to go we can open up our control panel and begin our start startup sequence. Before we turn the machine on there's a couple of checks that we need to do to ensure that we start the machine successfully. Firstly is the kill switch. We need to ensure that it's pulled out and in the starting position. Secondly, is the joystick lever is in the neutral position on your right hand side. Now, once you've done these two checks and your seat belt is engaged, you take your operator's key and pop it into the ignition on the right hand side of the control panel. Turn the machine to position one. Now to prime the engine, we're gonna hold the key just slightly past position one to prime that engine for five to 10 seconds. And then when you're ready, we're going to turn the key to position two to start the engine. You now have successfully started your Bomag 120 twin drum roller. Once you've finished with the machinery, you can simply key off to cut the engine and then you're safe to exit the machine using three points of contact. And there you go everyone, that is the correct startup procedure for one of our Bomag 120 twin drum rollers here available at WHC Hire. By following this simple step-by-step -step process you can guarantee you get your roller started every single time. Thank you ever so much for joining me but if you come into any more problems using this machinery feel free to scan the QR code that you'll find on the machine or alternatively get in contact with your local depot as soon as possible so we can get you up and running. Thank you once again for joining me and until the next one take care bye bye for now.